Hi, guys, and welcome to Usatility. Now we are going to understand how to download and install the Bleach Mobile 3D on PC so we can begin to play with mouse and keyboard on a large screen. Feeling surprised how an Android OS game will run on laptop or computer? Well, I'll teach you. Only focus on the display and keep an eye on the tutorial in depth. Therefore, here we go. The very first thing is actually to open our favorite internet browser, in our situation Google Chrome, and you're simply going to go to the URL located in the description of the video tutorial, or perhaps in the very first pinned comment. Here is the website link, I show it here in case you want to see it a little bit bigger. Simply click it, it will take you to this page of Bluestacks Bleach Mobile 3D. Bluestacks is actually a program to set up any kind of Android game on computer system therefore let us install Bleach Mobile 3D in this manner. It's an Android emulator, which emulates tablets or even Android mobile devices, therefore we can use a mouse and keyboard, use a large screen, etc. We go to the Download Bleach Mobile 3D for PC option, and then the downloading will begin. The download is done, here is the file. Click this downloaded file. Windows 10 might ask for permissions. To proceed installing, only accept the conditions. So as to look at game installer, it's advised to minimize the internet browser like this. Now let me choose the directory where I want to install this game. Directory can be selected simply by visiting Customize Installation. In order to proceed, please click here on Install Now and then installation will start. It will only take a few MBs from the memory space of your computer to download this specific file. The download of game depends on the net speed. It'll then set up the emulator on the desktop. The installation of the emulator is finished. Do not forget that the computer will require some time to make configurations for Bluestacks and launch it but the next time, it's going to launch instantly. The next task is important. Here is an option for Google Play, sign in, you have to click here. Sign in to Google Play by providing your email as well as password. You cannot continue to install this game without sign in because it's a Google Play game. I'll be back after this step. Look, we have now signed in our Google account. You will be required to accept the terms and for that, only hit on I agree, if you'd like to create the backup of your device in the cloud storage then click on yes or else, carry on by pressing no. Anyway, we have now ultimately come to our Google Play account. Anytime you would like to go to the desktop, hit on this particular arrow. You will notice these two icons, Bluestacks Multi Instance as well as Bluestacks. The first icon is to launch Bluestacks. Now, to set up this game, we will press this icon. It's the time to actually install Bleach Mobile 3D on computer so we can enjoy this enjoyable game on a large screen. Let's go to Google Play and additionally click Install. You know that there are a number of premium tools that you can obtain within the game and so for this purpose, you will have to choose Payment Mode in Google Play. We aren't going to buy anything at all, therefore we are going to choose the Skip button. Installation of the game is started out and now, Bleach Mobile 3D will be downloaded in the system. If you have swiftly internet connection it will not take too long to download Bleach Mobile 3D. I'll be back again after completion of this process so as to save your precious time. After installation, the icon of Bleach Mobile 3D is shown up on the computer's desktop and hence we are able to directly start the game. Each time when you will need to have fun playing the game, double-click Bleach Mobile 3D icon on your computer's desktop. Double-clicking icon of the game from desktop is one way to launch Bleach Mobile 3D and yet another way is to start it by means of Bluestacks. We're going to click on this Bluestacks icon to start Bleach Mobile 3D. Here is the keyboard setup if you'd like to configure it. Anyhow, keyboard configurations already appear ideal therefore we will undoubtedly close it. You'll definitely enjoy playing the game on a large screen. If so then you can get large screen in two ways. This is to maximize the emulator, you'll have a full screen having a border. It would not be a 100% full screen. By pushing F11, you'll get 100% full screen for the game. When you will start playing the game in full screen mode, you'll be able to better concentrate on the game. In case you have a powerful laptop then it will better aid gaming within an emulator. Let us now rapidly look over how you can alter the language of this game. To do this, you are expected to visit preferences. There are various languages available for this game. And that's translated. Anyway, here's the game setup. Really easy we will keep sharing such helpful videos for you therefore please subscribe to Usatility and give a thumb up to the video. We hope that you liked this video and we will bring more exciting stuff for you all. Bye.